Okay, so today I'm going to show you 12 useful LEG1 algs. Um, LEG1 is just the one, it's like EG1, except you have the bar on the left. So that way, if you get like a layer like um, face like this, you're not going to have to rotate. Um, the rest of my LEG1 algorithms that I use will be in the description. Um, that document is going to have some of those I've generated and others are from Chris's site and things. Um, there's a lot of other good ones, but these are just some to get you started off. Okay, so the first algorithm is just pure soon. Um, for this one, there's two algs that um, I've used before. The first one is just, um, it starts off with like a CLL. It's like R prime F, R two F prime, and then just to finish it off like that. Um, but the other one I, I currently use goes like this. It has a kind of like a regrip, but for some reason it's faster for me. It's like R prime F U two R two F R prime. Um, so yeah, they both have the same AUFs, but I do use the second one because I can execute it just a tiny bit faster. But um, if it goes better with the cancellations, then I use sometimes we'll do the other one too. So this next one here is another soon algorithm, um, just Nick, Nick Loss. This algorithm is a, maybe even faster than norm, normal one sometimes, but about as fast, I guess. Um, so you start off with a U, and then it's R2, U prime, R2, F prime, R, U2, R prime, U2, R prime, F. Uh, yeah, so that one's pretty fast. So this next one here is um, just pure anti soon. Um, the cell starts with the rotation, but after that it's pretty fast, and yeah, um, I use this quite a lot. Um, it goes like, well, so X prime, and then R, U prime, R2, U, R2, B2, R prime. So this case here is a, it's a pi case, diag pi. Um, this is a really EG, EG1 case, but sometimes it's better to do from this angle, and since the alg is so fast, if I don't have to rotate, I'll do this a lot of the times. So um, U prime, and then it's U sexy, R, U two, R U prime R two, and then that's it. So this next one is the checkerboard pi algorithm. Um, you start with a U prime for the um, to set it up, and then it's R two U, and then sledge so R prime F, R F prime and then you are primed to finish it off. Um, so for the last Pi case here, um, start with the same um, setup for this, but then you do R, U, R prime, U, R2, U prime, R2, F, R2, F prime. So that one's a little bit slower than the last one, but it's still quite useful in solves. So this first UK cell gets really fast. Um, you don't have to do setup for this, and then um, it goes like this, R, U prime, R, U, R prime, U, R, U, R2. So that one's really fast, and when I get that, um, it's usually very good solve. So for this next UK salg, it's actually, it's really fast, and a lot of people actually use this for their EG1 alg. Um, I believe Daniel Carnock did at some point, he told me. And um, so yeah, it's really easy, you just hold it like this. And then it's R U R prime F R two F prime R U prime R prime. So for this next L case, um, it's not great for EG one. So even though the style isn't the fastest, it um, still helps quite a lot for me. Um, so you start with R, wait, you start with it from the back, and then R U prime R prime U prime R two U prime R two F R F prime. So these next two T cases are pretty useful, especially this one. Um, this one you start well. You, both of these you're gonna start with a U, 
And then this first one here, it starts off with just sexy, so R, U, R prime, U prime, and then F prime, which I usually do with my thumb, and then R prime, U2, R, U prime, F. So for this T case, you know, again, you start off with the U, and then it's R, U prime, F, R2, F prime, U, R, U prime, R2.